gosh. Fixie, stop sniffing the camera. Okay, hello everybody and welcome back to another video. This is Pixie's video. Okay, get your face out of the camera, you silly girl. All right, so we're gonna walk over there. So I actually didn't have her by the log to start off with this time because I thought I'd start with explaining that Pixie was like my first horse. Well, okay. She was my second horse. First horse that I have, or that I still have. And she was born here, 2019. Come on. Which makes her four years old. Come on. Good girl. So she's four years old. And I actually took her this way first because her mom is somewhere over here in the same pasture with her. I just don't know where she went. I just saw her. Oh, I'm sorry. I tried to walk you under a tree branch. Alright. So I might as well start. Right now, Pixie's probably like 14 something. Like, she is not at all 15 hands. And she probably never will be. I'll be lucky if she like grows any more than she's growing now. And she was her mom's first foal. So, oh, there's her mom. Let's see, she's behind this shop right there. She's looking at you. Or, she's looking at me. Just the camera in general. So her mom's name is Aurora. So we made it to the log. She's just gonna stand around and watch now. Alright, so as I said, she's probably about like 14 something. So as you can see, she's a paint horse on both sides, her mom and her dad. And she's been to how many different trainers? She's been to two different trainers. The first trainer we sent her to got her started. Like, we were kind of just going to start her on like one month. So she just went there for like a month just to like start her i did most of the training at home with her like i've taught her how to lead how like to saddle and i put a bridle on her but like we just wanted come back here we just wanted to get like a trainer to get on her first so we sent her there for a month and then we are gonna let her rest for the winter and then we were gonna send her to another guy that was like really good with horses and I was taking lessons with him. And then by the time he had time to take her, he was like, like, I mean, he's older and he was not riding horses anymore or he was not breaking horses anymore. He was just like halter breaking young colts. So we still sent her there to like get more groundwork done. Chevy. Hello. Come on. He is in the way of my video. Okay. Anyway. So she got her groundwork done there, but he never got on her there. So hopefully this year she will go to another trainer, our main trainer. Come back up here. So hopefully she will go to another trainer and then I will finally be able to ride her because she's still four and we, we waited a long time because we didn't think she was ready because she was still super small. Remember when we took her to the first trainer for just like, that was the first time she was away for like a month. And when she came back, I was wondering if she thought that I like sold her because she was like, just attached to me like um she would like fight off the other horses if I went in the pen to like go pet them and she would just like follow me around and she's like no no you can't pet any other horses you have to spend all your time with me so it was that and then like this is usually not like that because like for itchy because her pecking order is usually like pretty low like i'd say she's like medium like she makes friends with a lot of horses and 
but like she's never friends with like the upper class horses if you know what I mean but yeah Chevy is still in the way come here there so but like whenever it comes to like if I'm in the pen with her and I'm like paying attention to another horse and I'm not paying attention to her Sometimes she'll just come up and like chase the poor other horse away. Actually, there's one more thing I'm going to tell you guys before I'm going to end this video because I feel like this one's going to be longer than all the other ones. Do you the froggy? And she sees the highway. But anyway, to my story. So. Actually, I remember this foal being born, and I I just like loved this horse. And she was like, she was small, and she was a black and white paint. I'll see if I can find a picture and post it on my community after this video. But she was small, and my grandpa told me that I could name her. So, I don't know, like, I'd never been fond, like, not fond of, but like, I just never thought of the name Pixie. But I ended up calling her Pixie. And then I already had a horse. Um, so, my mom told me that I couldn't keep Pixie because um, I already had a horse. And I was like, I was super young. I don't know how old I was. I was like five, it's like five or six. And she also didn't want me working with a younger horse because I was that young. And I mean, that, that makes sense. Come on, give me the water. So yeah, that makes sense. So I ended up selling her. And after that, my dream was to one day get a black and white paint horse. And I was gonna call her Pixie. Well, here, I'll just go back this way. Cause I don't feel like dropping my phone in the water again. And I don't feel like fighting with her either. Like I didn't want to really fight with Yellow to go across there. Anyway, I'm getting off topic again. So, I think it was like the next year, my horse that I had, um, he got into an accident and he ended up um very sadly his back legs collapsed and he couldn't get back up so we had to put him down and it was that summer i think it was like 2019 that pixie was born so i'm gonna end it here because like i said this is gonna be a long video so yeah, I'm not going to babble on longer. But I don't know who to do after this. Because there's Dolly. And then there's Moose. And no one's voted for Dolly or Moose. So I don't know whether I'm supposed to do Dolly or supposed to do Moose. I mean, you can comment to let me know if you want me to do Dolly or Moose. And, uh... Yeah, other than that, then I'll just, like, random number generate them. Like, Dolly 1 or Moose 2. And then put it in a random number generator. But, yeah. We'll see what happens. So, I'm actually going to end it this time. I will see you in my next video.